This is the amount of water sure. we are going to put in the diesel. And you can see the water here, the color of the water. Mm -hmm. And then the alarm kicks off because yeah. the water has already... And then you see, the, until it becomes clear, there's no more water in here. Right. But it's still collecting. Mm -hmm. And you can see the difference between the two. Here's, there's a lot of... There's uh, water still uh, water, water bubbles here. Yes, while there, they mm -hmm. don't have it. Nothing here. And then it comes here now. Normally now it starts to become clear. Right. There's a lot of water is already collected in here. So what we do, we stop it. Mm -hmm. And see it's mostly pure water, water coming out and then when we start seeing the diesel come out there we go there we start go. having okay. diesel coming out you see the diesel always lighter than water that's right and it comes out nice mm -hmm. is the same amount that we put in here we recuperated fully without being going to the engine part. That's fantastic. Okay. And it can hold actually more than this. We can put for this size we can put up to a liter. Up to a liter. Up to a liter. Okay. But the alarm will trigger off okay. at half a liter. Okay. Which is But in, in most instances you're not gonna have that much water going no, to the in most instances in real life we will have things like this. Sure. Which it takes a long time to accumulate that water, so regular drainage, every change of oil, will help in maintaining regular maintenance of the engine. Okay. You can touch it here, it's hot. Yes, it is very it warm. It about yeah. 40 degrees, yes. which it takes the heat from the diesel itself. Okay, okay, we'll be uh, going to the next uh, test in just a moment. Now we're on this. Okay. So we are going to start with the next experiment, is with using solid particles. It's actually sand that we got from construction site. It has a lot of fine particles plus the other ones. We will try, hopefully the pump will be able to pull up this diesel, contaminated diesel with sand. We'll try to get it through the thing and see it's going through the SFP here, it pulls try to get more into the uh, uh, can it directly to the hole. Oh. We are getting more sand in. to distinguish so that we can have more drain we will add water okay the alarm started sounding now 
we can see there is no sand going through over there, neither water. And that's the difference. So we stop it. And we are going to do the drainage. We need to put this in. Now I start to see the diesel is coming in. You see the water mixed with the sand contaminated pool. It's all in here. There's a large portion is probably still here because we didn't drain it all because solids is coming in. But it will as it goes on we can now, this is the type. The water actually attached to the sand particles and the water can mix actually with the sand and things. So if we let it to rest the sand will separate with all the dust in.